So let's begin with a task and we want to create a feature branch. So let's say we want to start working on it. We create a branch. For this, of course, we need to ensure that our RoadDevops is connected to Jira. Here we have our DevOps project. Here we have our main branch, dev10. We create a branch. So here's our created branch, Azure DevOps for Jira 10. We have bin and we basically let's edit the file. Demo commit the 10 directory file. Let's commit. Let's create a pull request. So here's our branch and here's our commit with a pull request. We can go and approve it. It's approved and now we can enlarge it. Searched. So from if you see our pull request is merged and now we're waiting for the successful builds or unsuccessful. Here we have our deployment is running, so it is in progress. And very soon our deployment is also will be shown in the deployments. As we see here, we see multiple our deployments. So here we can see that one of our deployments succeeded. Now our another deployment continues. We have a successful build as well. Build passed. Deployments and progress. As you see, we have our UA and UAT deployments, production de default and develop and build are done. So now we can explore how all these builds are visible. And if you jump into the deployment deployments screen, you can see that now our dev10 move hard with Azure DevOps and Jira are deployments in progress. And of course, clicking there, you can see what's going on. So all deployments become very visible, including pull requests, branches, merges, and many other things.